Hello, welcome back half timers to another episode and today we'll be previewing the 200 meters for women and I think all eyes will be placed on Sharika Jackson who has a season's best of 21.41 seconds. She is in fact the fastest woman over 200 meters alive and I, I know it's, it's not the field that we would have expected and it's probably not the field that will push her to the world record but nonetheless it's quite an intriguing field. And Jenna Prandini, Anthony Strahan, and we have a surprise in this one as Jasmine Camacho Quinn, who we, we are accustomed to her running in the 100 meter hurdles, she will be lining up in the 200 meters as well. Her personal best is 22.27, which is actually better than a couple of the other athletes lining up in this 200 meter. Sharika Jackson, she will be the overwhelming favorite, and we expect Jenna Prandini and Anthony Strahan to push her to the limit. I think she's been virtually um, uncontested this season. I don't think this is a race that she'll actually lose uh, when it comes down to 200 meters as she she's she's spotless in this the 2023 season. Next year is the year of the Olympics and although I originally expected Sharika Jackson to break the record this year, we may have to wait until next year at the Olympics primarily because of the competition that she's up against. Personally, I think athletes perform their their best when they're up against a, a full field of competent athletes that will push them all the way to the finish line. I don't think this is it. So the starters are Jasmine Camacho Quinn, Sharika Jackson, we have Tassa Gia out of the Netherlands, we have Mabondu Kone out of Cote d'Ivoire, we have Daryl Neat out of Great Britain, Delphine and Kansa out of Belgium, Jenna Prandini as I mentioned a little bit earlier the United States and Anthony Strahan. I'm curious to hear what you, the viewers and subscribers, have to say. What are your expectations from the 200 meters, especially from Sharika Jackson? Let us know in the comment section. Until next time.